The nuts on tour, rolling in the motor home, moving town to town, never feel alone. Hello, good evening, and welcome to the wreck of the Esperus. <laughs> Well, that's, that's what it looks like at the moment. It looks like a bomb's gone off in here. <laughs> this, is, this is what the bus looks like when we've just come back and we're in the middle of cleaning it down. There, all the covers are off, all the bedding is off, and it looks like the wreck of the Esperus. Oh, yeah. I haven't vacked yet either. Yeah, you should see it. Oh, oh, here we are. <laughs> in the... Wreck the Here we are in the wreck, yes. No, no, when we get back, the first thing strip I do it. the uh, sorry, strip it out. Yeah, <laughs> two strips off. I mean, sorry, sorry, uh, <laughs> two strips the bus out. Uh, I do the uh, the toilet tank and the grey waste tank, and that's uh, that's empty now and all cleaned again, mm -hmm. ready to go out. And so we'll do all the washing. And then, That's uh, currently going on. The well, house looks like a Chinese laundry and the bus looks like the wreck of the Esperus. There you go. <laughs> so uh, we, have a, we have a plea. We have a plea. For our Van Other Collective next month, the beginning of, we are doing a question and answer session. So can you please... Send in your questions. Please. Those of you who follow us, you know, if there's anything you want to know that we haven't already spoke about, or if we have spoke about and you haven't seen that video, whatever. Anything on anything. Any, anything on any of the subjects, the buses, the shows we go to. Sites, whatever. Sites, the puppies, anything. Give us, a, you know, write your questions into us, either on comments, comments below, or face it. Face aches easier. Instagrams, well, yeah, you would find them, but any. I'd say just Facebook and Facebook, YouTube, and YouTube, whatever, whatever you can contact us on. Send us the uh, or our Gmail. Nuts on tour, yeah. yeah. Nuts on tour at Gmail. You can send us to that or yeah. send it to them. Send them to it. Yeah, send the questions, yeah. Laura, and we will answer as many as we can in the video, which will be out in a couple of weeks. Three, three weeks yeah away. but we have to we need yeah. the questions we need the questions sooner rather than later because we need to do answers for, for him. him yeah <laughs> right the rest of this video not not going to show you me cleaning the black tank or me cleaning the outside of the bus again you've seen that and you've seen sue you know how to do washing and ironing you do, don't need to see sue do no. that no. so the rest of this did some more van reviews when we were at uh Newbury Ooh, and some okay. thought you meant Lincoln but hey, and some more at Lincoln hey. yes so I will put on a couple of van reviews so you can see the different vans the descriptions will be above below wherever uh -huh. oh, posty. right got to go on with the vid enjoy bye good morning morning what is the time now Nine oh, seven minutes past nine and we're on the road we're heading down the A15 towards Sleaford and then onto the A17 and towards home it's a murky, murky day at least it's not torrential rain at the moment which is what's being forecast but uh, yeah we're on we're on on the road again on the road again Traffic's a bit busy around Lincoln. I suppose that's to be expected with people going to work. But uh, yeah, this bit of road's quite nice. It's a new bit, or well, new to us anyway. So yes, it's Mr. and Mrs. Satnag are both doing a lovely job. Yes, yes. Now that they've got their act together. Yes. Take the second exit. We're running a Falcon with the Falcon software and we're running uh, my phone, Z Fold 4, which is running Road Loads or as it's now been renamed, your Euro old bag. Yeah. So uh, they've both got the length and the weight and the wheels and all that lot. So uh, it should 
all being well, work out the correct road and what we can and can't do and speeds that we can and can't do. Keep us all legal. I do have the same system on my phone, but at the moment it's having a bit of difficulty finding where it is. So operator I'm, error! So operator I'm error! Ignoring it. It gives me a map, but there's no clues. Hey ho, there you go. Right, we will get back to you in a short while. And here we are on the Loudons stand. Uh, according to their sign, I'll turn this round for you. According to the line, two year ultimate warranty, two years full warranty, unlimited mileage, no excess to play on claims, unlimited claims. Every unlimited used motorhome comes with three, two years warranty, two years breakdown, home recovery, yada yada yada. You can pause it and pause screen and uh, have a read at that. But what I've come to look at at the moment is this sunlight. Yes, there you are. Four bed, four belt, 7.41 meters, only a three and a half tonner. Was 85420, now 79995. Saving of nearly five and a half thousand pounds. Can't be bad. So we'll put that on. So there you are. The step up and in. LED lighting around so this is on a Fiat stepping in you've got a single seat to the right hand side pilot and co-pilot seat and then an L-shaped lounge with the obligatory sliding oh I'll say sliding table I think I think that's actually locked yeah it was locked so uh, that's it unlocked and that will slide forwards and backwards and also side to side so it slides out of the way and then as I said it's on the Fiat with the nine speed automatic cup holders the alarms flashing at us and you've got two cup holders down cup holder above 12 volt power USB no radio on this one that I can see the passenger or co-pilot gets an escape door the driver just gets an escape window and then on this side you've got your two belted seats to make your four up and you're into your kitchen so in your kitchen you've got a nice little round sink makes a tap swivels out the way two burner hob on gas Underneath you have a grill oven and then uh, a drawer below that. Stepping back you've got a step up and then you're into your shower on one side and your toilet and wash basin on the other. Quite astounding they've got them different on different sides considering the size of the van. And then looking backwards, it's an EB bed. So you've got two single beds with the infill plate. And I presume this bit, yeah, that bit pulls backwards and forwards to make it into, uh, I think that would actually come up as a king size. Underneath, you've got cupboards below, obviously. And yeah, nice deep cupboard on that side with a hanging rail yeah so plenty of storage under there and then open that one which closes to there and you have your toilet like that yes you've got your toilet your obligatory mirror hello shelf space above it's a Thetford toilet and then if I turn round on that side you have your shower very nice also at the shore are Euro Cruiser these are the fifth wheelers that actually can be towed with a normal B and E driving license so you can get a, a rig like that 
which is the uh, the Ranger. They're selling that one for 30 grand. And you put the toe plate in the back like that. That bolts down and that gives you your fifth wheel. And then that will couple up to any of the three vans they've got here. There's three different vans they've got here. That's one, that's the other, and that's the third one. The prices on these, they're actually showing four here. They've got the 835 light, three and a half ton, the 975 light, three and a half ton, the 965 and the 995, all weigh in at three and a half ton. And they can be towed with a normal B&E license, like I just said. If you have the vehicle to pull them, there you go. A lot of vehicle for not a lot of money. Considering the size, if you took an A-class this size, where you have your own engine, you'd be looking at a one in front of that figure, at least. So this is the 965 up the steps into this there you go an island kitchen in the middle your slide out unit is your dining room and two I call them easy boy recliners but two large reclining seats all in leather double seat at the back humongous telly I think that's bigger than the telly in our house. Proper fireplace. Cupboards. I oh, will give you a... Open the cupboards up. They are nice deep cupboards. Yeah, same above. <laughs> Absolutely lovely. Microwave above your air extractor. Above your cooker with grill and oven below and then three burner three burner gas hob above yeah more storage more storage down this side and then I think this is Corrie yeah lovely deep sink with your soap dispenser and your tap and then into your pantry and more storage yet again haha <laughs> we found their goodie store there you go the Christian chocolate store and if you need to be away for any length of time there's your washing drying machine excellent so then it's up three steps and into your bathroom and your bedroom area so these are roped off at the moment but there's a shower that is a two-person shower huge shower with a skylight above and then your porcelain toilet no plastic here porcelain toilet with expel air fan above there you are shaving area so we'll be happy about that and then into your bedroom there you are, that looks, a that looks a long bed. I'd say that's longer than a six foot bed. I can't get in there, but I'd say that's longer than a six foot bed. That might be a six foot, six foot four or six foot six bed. And then cupboards either side, windows either side. And you've got storage, it's roped off, but you have got storage around that side as well very nice very well laid out pop she's going to run a hide <laughs> and here we are at corner farm catering we came yesterday and devoured some of their cakes and i've just been back and bought another four they were that good mind you i did eat three of them myself so i had the other one there you go a selection of lemon bakewell millionaire shortbread old school She's getting out some more of the white chocolate and Biscoff, because that's what I've just had. There you go, say hi. Hi. And 
carrot cake, cornflake tart, cornflake brownie and scotch eggs. So if you're feeling peckish and you've got a sweet tooth, I've got a whole set of them, get yourself down here. Open sky so blue